All right, uh, I'm going to throw this pool oil on my grandma's getting another worm on there. We have a lot of worms left. Throw this guy out there. This is probably, this is an old Daiwa pool I got when I was very little. It's a really good pool. Um, there you go. Bluegill fishing is a fun thing to do. If you ever looking for something to do with your family, go bluegill. If you're ever looking for a little, if you're ever looking to go fishing with your family, and you have little kids, if I were you, I would go bluegill fishing because it's a fun thing to do, and my grandpa's got a bluegill, so. You can catch bluegill anytime, pretty much, and they're fun fish to catch. All you need is a pole, some bait, and a hook, and you're all set to go fishing for bluegill. Bluegill are one of the simplest fish to catch. I'll use that while you get a new worm on. Okay. All right. Uh, I'm just going to get another worm on. I'm going to throw this out there and catch another bet. Big boy. Watch this. Three, two, oh. Oh, that's a nice one. It's a fun fight on this thing. It's another nice one. Nice. Here we go. Well, I'm gonna unhook them. The water's kind of cold. Well, it's about, it's in the 60s right now, I would say. And the water temperature is probably the high 50s. So yeah, they'll just warm back out there and catch another fish. My grandpa's getting to fight already. Here, we got one. The pool's messed up. Dean, I'm gonna bite. Another. Oh! oh. Ooh, sneakers. That would have been the third double of the night. My grandma's got one. Nice one. There you go. Oh my god. Must be little ones that I'm getting. Lights are. Ultra lights. Okay, so I fixed my camera. I mean, I fixed my pool. My grandma was just getting a bite. Um, the pool got wrapped around again. If I were you, people, I if you were going to bluegill fishing, I would try to find a pool like my grandpa's using because you really don't have any trouble with them. They're really light pool. There you go. Ooh, it's a nice one. Ooh, it's a nice one. And they cast well. I caught I caught a seven a seven and a four pound largemouth on ten pound test line with that pool. Um and this this ultra light is kind of a pain in the neck, but if you're a real big spinning reel spinning real spinning pool combo, then I recommend you get in a one of those. Like I said before, nice fish. These bluegill are just active. Wow, my grandma's gonna bite already when I hit the water. I missed them again. Must be small fish. So, hope you guys are enjoying. Oh, I get the bite right when I hit the water. Ah, crap. Uh, I hope you guys are enjoying this episode so far. If you're not, please give me an idea of what you guys want to see. If you guys want to see a tackle video, or just leave that in the comments below. Um, so yeah, just need to catch more fish. This is a fun day. Um, yeah. Oh, I had a bite right when I hit the water. That's like, oh my gosh. Oh, he let go. Stupid little fucker. My grandpa's getting a bite. So you can get that fish. Oh, I got, um, 
This is a nice one too. He's just, we're just letting them take it. We got him, right? Oh, he lost him. Well, we're just letting them take it because if you set the hook too early, you're gonna lose it, probably lose their worm and the fish, so. We're just letting them take it before you know they have it and then we're setting the hook. Why I hit a bite? Oh, I had a bite right when it hit the freaking water. <sighs> Cleaned my hook. I forgot I was getting a bite. Well, I can get the fish. Get the fish, get the fish. Oh, my like God, I was going to get a new worm on here for me. And I will fish with this pole. Our blue girl is just cleaning the bait. What did you say? I wonder if he got the worm on this one too. Mm -hmm. Oh, a lot of them. There's, oh, there you go. There you go. A lot of fish are jumping right now. I don't know if you can, there you go. There you go. Nice fish. Nice fish. you will take it. Let's see if I can get it. Also, whenever you're fishing, um, if you're fishing with a pole like this, see a big fish right there. If you're fishing with a pole like this, whenever you get a bite or a bass, whatever kind of fish, you would always want to do a sidewinder like that because then it jerks the hook in the mouth. If you do a, if you jerk it straight up in the air, then you're not pulling anything. So I kind of just it over there a little more so you can get the fish. I'm gonna record this out there. There's a lot of fish jumping along this shoreline. I might try to get some bass later. And he cleaned the hook too. <laughs> uh, so yeah. Here. Oh, there, I'm gonna bite, I'm gonna bite, I'm gonna bite. He's had a bite. Oh, see, he was the blue girl. They're fighting, like right when it hits the water. They don't bite for a few couple minutes, and then that's and then they come back after it. I'm gonna recast it. It's about a foot bobber line because we're, we're only just last time we were using about a foot and a half bobber line, but today we're just gonna try a little something different with a foot bobber line. There you go. Nice fish. Oh, let's go. <laughs> well, this, we came here around four o'clock and um, catching a lot of fish. We caught a lot more before. Um, I started filming. Things are too small. I think my grandma's getting a bite. Yeah, my grandma's. Oh, I'm getting a bite too. My grandpa got that fish. Oh. I went to There you go. <sighs> Little ones. Little ones. Pain in the neck. I think we need to hook now, thank gosh. Yeah. There's a lot of fish jumping out there, which makes it more exciting. Oh, there we go. Head a bite, head a bite. Got him. That's a nice one. Nice one. Nice little sunfish and bluegill hybrid. And hook this guy and we'll let him go and we'll catch more fish. My grandma's gonna bite. Looks like a little big one again. So it's just the little for these ones that are cleaning the necks. They're the ones that keep cleaning our hooks. Oh, oh that's a nice tug. 
throw this guy back out there. Wow, get a bite again. Get a bite. Ooh, that was a nice tug. You come back, I'll set it. Ooh, ooh. Wow. It's a nice one. Another nice one. My grandpa's gonna bite. Another double! <laughs> Yeah, that's what we're talking about. Yeah, another double. They have big tails, yeah. They look like the exact same fish. <laughs> that's like, what is that? Four doubles, I think? Yep. It's a lot. My grandpa's are better on hookers than me. He needs a new worm. I don't. So ha. Huh? Well, this, this episode is really exciting. It's gonna be. A, I'm gonna have to probably put this in two parts. So.